Here's how to fix a ghost touch on your iPhone. Now, if your iPhone is acting erratic, maybe you're tapping one place, but it's actually tapping somewhere else, or maybe you're not even touching it at all, but it's registering a tap and opening up something or doing something that you didn't want it to do. I'm gonna show you how to fix that. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. Really helps me out. Thanks guys. Now, the first thing you can do is open up your settings. And in here, there is an accessibility that will help reduce this. So tap on accessibility right under general here. And then you can see if I scroll down a bit, you can see touch. Tap on that. And now on here, you can see midway down, it's touch accommodations. It says if you're having trouble touching the screen, adjust the following steps. And basically you can turn this on and it will help you to be able to reduce or eliminate those ghost touches. So turn this on and you can see it is enabled here. And the key is on here, you wanna make sure ignore repeat is turned on and you can bump this up to a bit higher, 0.2 seconds or 0.15 seconds. Essentially the ignore repeat means if you accidentally kind of tap one place and then tap another, it will ignore repeated touches. And then on top of that, you'll have to kind of tap and hold on something to be able to turn it off. So tap on hold on it. So that is one thing that you can do that a lot of times fixes those ghosts touching. However, it could also be an issue with this screen itself on your iPhone. So a lot of times people have screen protectors on there and they get smudged and that prevents your iPhone screen from registering an actual touch when you just tap. Now keep in mind, if it is that iPhone screen protector, you can just remove it and clean and wipe off that screen and then you should be able to use it and it shouldn't have any of those ghost touches. Now let's go back here. Another option that you can do is just tap on general and then scroll to the very bottom and hit shut down. You'd be surprised how many times just turning a phone off and rebooting it. A lot of times people keep their phones running for days and weeks without ever restarting it. And just restarting your phone a lot of times fixes any kind of bugs or glitches, including those haptic or ghost touches where you might touch one place, but it registers that you touch somewhere else and it's acting kind of erratic or not how you want it to. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks guys.